Hello everyone, I am Aradhana and I am Sajini. We are started this YouTube channel to help us and others to learn grade 8 subject easily. Today we are going to start with science lesson 1. Greetings to everyone. Today we are going to see CBSC syllabus chapter 1 science biology, crop protection and management, topic and explanation, definition of crop, what is a crop. When plants of the same kind are cultivated at one place on a large scale, it is called a crop. Crop depends on season for their growth. What are the types of crops? There are three types of crops. Carif crops, rabi crops and zad crops. Carif crops grow on rainy season, June to September. Example, paddy, cotton, etc. Rabi crops grow on winter season, October to March. Example, wheat, pea. Zad crops grown in short time, end of one season and the beginning of another season. They do not depend on climate. Example, cucumber, pumpkin. What is agriculture? Systematic cultivation of useful plants and the rearing of animals for human needs such as food, fiber and other useful products is called agriculture. What is agriculture practices? Sequence and process of activities undertaken by farmers in order to cultivate crops for human need is called agriculture practices. Agriculture practices are done in six steps. Number one, preparation of soil. Number two, selecting and sowing of seeds. Number three, irrigation. Number four, crop protection. Number five, harvesting. Number six, prevention and storage of harvesting. Explanation of preparation of soil. Major process in agriculture for preparation of soil to grow crops. Soil is prepared in three steps. Plowing, leveling, applying manure and fertilizer. The process of losing and turning the soil into seed bed is plowing or tilling. Plowing is done with help of plow which is usually made of wood or iron. Plowing helps mixing organic matter so it helps in increasing its nutrient content and fertility. It is also beneficial to earthworms and microorganisms. Modern method of plowing is done by machines such as tractors which make the process more easy. Leveling of soil. Field may still have large pieces of soil called clods even after plowing. Leveling helps soil surface for sowing and irrigation. Applying manure and fertilizer. The substance which are added to the soil in the form of nutrient for healthy growth of plants are called manure and fertilizer. Manure, natural organic matter less rich in plant nutrient for example cow dung and fruits and vegetable waste fertilizer man made in organic salt and chemical substance very rich in nutrient for example phosphate and urea explanation of selecting and sowing of seeds good quality seeds are very important seeds which are small discolored and deformed may be damaged or diseased. Farmers can collect healthy seeds from government organizations such as National Seed Corporation. Sowing. The process of planting seeds in soil for cultivation is called sowing. Seeds should be sown at correct depth, get enough air, depth enough safe from birds, spaced away from each other. Types of sowing. There are two types of sowing. Manual sowing, mission sowing. Manual sowing. The process of scattering seeds by hand is called broadcasting. It is the quickest and cheapest method. Do not need skilled labors. Sowing using implements. Modern implement used is called seed drill. Seed drill are moved by bullocks or tractors. It saves time and labor. Sow seeds uniformly and covers the soil after sowing. Thus protects seed from birds. Explanation of Irrigation the supply of water to crops at regular interval is called irrigation. Source of irrigation. The source of irrigation are well, tube well, pond, 
lake, river, dam, etc. Traditional method of irrigation. Moth. It is also called as pulley system. Chain pump. Dikli. Rahat. It is also called as liver system. Canal irrigation. Modern method of irrigation. Some examples are sprinkler irrigation and drip irrigation. Sprinkler irrigation. Useful on uneven land. Consist pipe that transport water to the fields. It has rotating nozzle. Drip irrigation. Best technique. More efficient method. Water falls drop by drop near the roots. So called as drip system. Crop protection. Crop should be protected from weeds and pests. Weeds. In the fields, many undesirable plants may grow naturally along with the crop called weed. Removal of weed is called weeding. It is done manually or applying weedicides. Types of weeding. Manual weeding and applying weedicides. Manual weeding is done by hand or implements such as hoe, trowel, apply weedicides. They are chemical that kill weeds. For example, neem extract. Protection from pest. Pests are organism cause damage to crops. For example, mice. Pesticides are chemical substance for killing the pest. Explanation of harvesting. The process of cutting and gathering ripened crops is called harvesting. Done manually or mechanical method. Manual harvesting done by hand. Implements such as cradle, sickle are used. Mechanical harvesting. It is the easiest, cheapest and time efficient way to do harvesting. Harvesting next undergo threshing. The process by which plants are beaten in order to loosen the grains. Done manually or machine called combined harvester. Next it undergoes winnowing. The chaff is separated from the heavier grains by process called winnowing. Done manually or help of machine called winnowing machine. Explanation of storage. Farmers store grains in jute bags. Large scales of grains is stored in silos and granites to protect from rats etc. We have completed the lesson. Hope you understand it easily. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank, Thank you. you.